Hey guys, we're back with another video. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ciao, Bella! Today I woke up like a little bit under the weather. Last night, my room was so warm and stuff, and I went to sleep with shorts. I woke up this morning, my room was freezing. I woke up kind of like a little cold. This video, I wanted to show you guys how I did my faux for a rug. I've always wanted to have a rug like this, but it was always too expensive. There's a lot of you guys out there who actually want to buy a rug like this, but I mean, it's kind of pricey. So, I want to show you guys um, um, how to do it. It's so easy, guys. So easy. If I can do it, you guys can do it. I showed you guys all the steps of how to do it. I spent only less than $50. Let me know if you want to do it. Let me know if you will be doing it. Comment down below. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. I'll leave my social media on the side. Share this video with your friends and your family. So, let's get started. So one of the first things that I used was this rug mat and it was 5 by 8 and I got this at Walmart. It was like $14. And I also got this 2 yards fabric. I'll leave the correct name down below. I also got this spray adhesive. This thing glues like crazy so yeah you're going to need that as well. You're going to need some scissors to cut the corners if you want and also a sharpie. So what you're first going to do, of course, I got the two yards foo fur rug. And this was at Joann Fabrics. You can get it at anywhere, I'm pretty sure. Um, at any fabric place. So for the first step, you are going to roll out, unfold that fabric that I showed you in the beginning. I'm not sure the name of it, but I will leave it. Um, I'll leave the correct name in the box below. So what I'm doing here is that you're going to first um, spray the um, spray adhesive on the first part, um, on one part, and then you're going to roll out the fabric so you want it to stick, you know. So you're going to repeat the, the same process over and over again until all the fabric is on the fur rug. And you have to make sure um, when you spray the spray adhesive um, and then you stick the quilt onto the rug, you have to pat it out a little bit so there's no like little bumps. Um, what happened to mine there were there was a couple of little bumps, but that was okay. Make sure to not have like a lot of bumps. So now after you're done putting all the um that quilt, that cotton thing, I don't even know. <laughs> you're going to get the rug pad and you're going to spray it on the same thing you did with that quilt. Um, with that other fabric, you're going to do with the rug pad, but you're going to um, spread it all out because it's like the correct side size. Yeah. So there were a couple of um, rug pad extra extra fabric. So what I did was I cut the excess um, fabric and um, I just took it out. You know, it would be like the correct size. And last but not least, I sprayed some sprayed adhesive on the side of the rug pad because, you know, some sides were not really sticky. So I just wanted to make sure, you know. And finally, I just flipped it upside down and look how gorgeous it is. So soft. I am so in love with this rug, guys. It's amazing. Amazing. It was so worth my time. The rug is so soft, I could legit sleep on this rug. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Love you guys, and ciao.